<laughs> See if we can get in some trouble here. <laughs> they don't really like us filming inside, but we're bad. <laughs> so we're here to get some steel wool. We're looking to set it on fire and see if an iPhone 8 can survive the inferno. No, I don't know how I don't know how hot it burns. This will be an interesting experiment. I don't know how hot the flaming steel wool will burn, so it might not uh, might not damage it, or it might completely destroy it. I honestly don't know. Is this maybe what we're looking for. Yeah. Ooh, that looks good. That looks like good stuff. Yeah. So the three is that guy, and the four is that guy. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. You want it in the bag? Uh, sure. Yeah, that'd be great. Thank Have you. Nice Appreciate day. it. <laughs> okay. All right, here we are. Let's do this. Look at that screen. No fingerprints. Doop. Steel wool. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Dang. Look at that. Oh, that is so sick. Wow. Okay, here we go. We've got the iPhone set up here, and uh, we are going to set it on fire in multiple spots. This will be our first test of steel wool versus an iPhone. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. Oh, that is hot. It's getting so warm. That is really hot, actually. Whoa. Like, that is toasty. Like, I wouldn't want to touch it, actually. I wonder if it's, we're going to get an overheating warning from the iPhone. Oh, that is amazing. Here we go, attempt number two. Okay, you ready? Ready. All right, we're blowing on it. Three, two, one. That is so cool. <gasps> it's overheating right there. Look, oh, it's, it's burning. It's burning up the iPhone in the corner right there. Wow. Oh, temperature warning. Yeah, that's crazy. We got it to go over the temperature awesome. warning. Did it just shut down? Yeah. Wow. It just did. Oh, I bet it's oh it's super hot. Emergency only use. Whoa, check out this right here. Is it like magnetic there or something? Like what? That is super weird. It won't go away. Okay. There. So it looks like the phone's A okay. Let's go ahead and wrap it in this strap. It's gonna be tricky to get it to hold. I don't know how to do this, but I'm trying my best. Nice, this might actually work. Okay, so the main limiter for this flaming steel wool to catch is the oxygen coming in and fueling the fire. It'll burn really fast if you've got lots of oxygen. So what we're gonna do is we got the iPhone here. The goal is to whip the iPhone around completely covered in steel wool, and it's just gonna burn really, really fast. And we'll see if that is enough to actually permanently damage the iPhone. All right, here we go. I've always wanted to do some of the steel wool photography where you're like whipping it around in a circle. I can't believe I'm getting to do it when I'm doing it around an iPhone. That way the iPhone doesn't fly out either, because otherwise we might have a flying slingshot iPhone, and that's not gonna be the point of the test. Okay, all right, sweet. Let's do a couple test swings before we light it. Okay, we're looking pretty good. <laughs> Where did the iPhone go? Oh my god! The iPhone went skipping! Where did it go? What the some of the flaming seal wool landed on top of my head and like like really hurt. The iPhone went flying, like the steel wool burned away and I think the straps got looser, so the iPhone just went flying. And oh here it is, over here. Check it out. 
Oh man, the glasses. Oh, it's super hot. Oh my God, it's still working. Oh my God. Okay, you need so, to wear heat gloves. Whoa, the brown goop on the back. It's the, it's the strap itself melting down from the heat. We can pull this apart. Look at that, it just comes right apart. That's why the phone went flying. I thought the strap would be okay. It, it, was, it was clearly not. All right, so check this out. The screen is actually really damaged. I'm not sure if you can see this very well. I'm gonna try to darken it down. It's actually like a yellowish color from being burned by the steel wall. Same in that corner right there. So yeah, it actually got permanently damaged. Steel wool wins, I guess. We've got some serious burn marks, like right here, some soot, a whole bunch of the, the strap melted down and like stuck to it. It's like on there really good. And then we, of course we got the glass shattered. I don't think glass shattered obviously from the heat. I think it shattered from the impact of flying out of the strap. This was, a, this, was a, this was a crazy experiment. This reminds me a lot of when I um, set an iPhone on fire and then dropped it into a pool of water uh, from 100 feet and I tried to do that. It, it's, that was probably the most dangerous episode I've ever done. Anyway, uh, if you wanna go check out the flaming iPhone into a pool of water, link down below. That video was pretty awesome or annotation at the end. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more awesome videos and hit that notification bell if you really want to know when I post new videos. Anyway, that's it for this episode. We'll see you next time, Brandon and Kara. Ka. Out. <laughs> Bye. Hi,